Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have an exciting DIY. I'm going to show you how I created this wreath. Um, it's my spin on fall and I hope you enjoy it. This is all Dollar Tree items again. So the things you're going to need is this willow wreath. I got this at the Dollar Tree. And you're also going to need this like greenish grass. I know there's like moss and stuff, but I couldn't find any of that, so I just used this. And you're just going to want to take your glue gun and just put glue all over the willow wreath and just press this grass onto the wreath um, until it's completely covered. Now, it doesn't really matter if you have some of the willow wreath peeking through. I think that's kind of cute. It doesn't have to be completely covered in the grass, but for the most part, it should be a green wreath. And again, this is my take on a fall wreath. I am, I want to say my style is like contemporary shabby chic. Um, but if you're into the very classic fall colors, you can feel free to use your oranges and your browns in this wreath. Um, I opted to use like springish colors just because it goes with my um, decor in my apartment. But again, use my ideas guys and make it your own. So once the wreath is completely covered in the green grass or whatever it's called, I'm going to use this little tin here. I got it at the Dollar Tree too. It came with three of these. I'm using the one that says thankful. There's one that says welcome and one that says harvest. Um, I like this because I can use it for fall. I can use it for spring. I can use it all year round just because it says thankful and um, it goes nicely with my living room decor too. So as you can see here, I'm just gluing down two roses on the bottom just to give it a little something something. Then I'm taking my decorative rope, also from the Dollar Tree, and I'm cutting off a small, um, I guess, piece. And I'm just looping it through my wreath. And that is it. That's This is so incredibly easy. You can make this as like elaborate as you want. Add as many things as you want to add. But I think this is so cute. I opted to put it over my mirror. Now, this mirror says something great is going to happen. I know there's a lot going on because of the words. But it is the mirror that I have over my fireplace right now. Eventually I will change it. But I still think it looks really, really cute. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to hit the like button, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye, guys.